Hey, it's Diane from Snaps, Grabs, and Stamps, and welcome to my YouTube channel. This weekend, I went to a really cool fabric flea market in Atlanta, and I wanted to bring you along. Let me know in the comments, and as always, be sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. If you're interested, come on down 3520 West Hospital Avenue in Chambly. It is the um, Fiber Arts 2018. You want to come on down. The prices are great. I have my bags, and I am going to go home and show it to you later on. So I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one, and I will see you later. Bye. Hey, everyone. I am back from my excursion today, so we'll see who is around. I know it's a nice sunny Saturday um, afternoon, but I wanted to pop in real quick to show you what I did today at the um, flea market. And it was really a good day to do that. I'm just trying to recuperate a little bit because the traffic in Atlanta is just crazy. I'm like, I said, where is everybody going today? I don't know where they're going. But um, I was like, wow. It was unbelievable. Everybody was just everywhere. I know it's nice outside, but that traffic, it, I think, just made me tired. But anyway, um, today I went to the Southeast Fiber Arts Alliance, and I never heard of this before. But it is a fine arts community. And they have um, great programs. They have monthly meeting programs. They have bi-weekly open studio sessions. They have lectures, classes and workshops, tours, events, exhibitions, studio, and rental facilities. I, I never heard about. I never heard of it before. But it was quite engaging to be there today um, to attend the uh, 2018 flea market. And of course, you know when you are a crafter that you have all of this stuff, which you can see back here, okay? All of this stuff that you get that you don't know what to do with. And you just don't throw it away. So what a great idea is to bring it down to here and you can get to sell the stuff that you, um, that you have. So I'm gonna show you what I got today. And all of this, I think, came to about maybe 20 something dollars. 
And I didn't think that was bad. I thought that was really kind of good. So I'm going to show you what it is that I got. Now, this first little bag that I have here, this was by, they were selling things by the pound. So you could take the fabric out by the pound and they would weigh it and then you pay for it. So I think this bag, I think maybe cost me like a dollar. But I got some really nice fabrics with that. And then I saw this, it's a cute little fire truck pattern. And you know, I'm going to Boston a couple of weeks for my dad's 90th birthday. Who dad? Um, and he was a lieutenant in the fire department. So I'm thinking maybe I might make him a mug rug or something. I mean, what can I make out of this fabric right here? But I'll think about it. It's really cool. And then of course, there's a couple of little batiks. You can always use, you know, white squares. So that was not bad. I mean, this was by the, um, this was by the pound. So that was good. Now, what I really, 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 no, let me start with this one here. Hold on a second. Then I got these. Look at this. Isn't this beautiful? These are batik scrap packs. And let's just see if we can open them up. They're so cute the way she put it on the card just to show you what it is. But let's just open this up just a little bit so we can see what it looks like, what we got here. Let's see. Oh, this is cute. And these are big scrap packs, too. I mean, these are just not, you know, little pieces. These are very, very huge huge scrap packs of nice batik material so hey Joyce how you doing so this was really cute that they had down there today so that was one pack uh, let's see here's another batik scrap pack let's open this one up and see what's in this one uh, oh yeah look at these hmm these are really really nice so all in all, for this bundle here, this bundle here, I paid, let me see, what's this? Four, $4.50 for this pack and $10 for this. Now, you can't go wrong with that at all. That is great. So I'm excited about that. Now, here comes the good part. They had these scrap bags, okay, these squares, a dollar. The whole bag was a dollar, okay? The whole bag. Look at this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take them out so you can see exactly what is in the bag. And they're already cut. Look at that. These are already cut a dollar for the entire bag. With this, you can make a scrappy quilt real quick. You can just take all of these and stitch these together. I mean, I think that would be kind of a good project. Let me go on to the next bag. Here's another one. Let's see what's in here. I don't even know what's in here, but we're gonna check it out. Look at oh. Look at, look at these fabrics. These are just wonderful. I think maybe I'm gonna stand up a little so you can see. Isn't it great? Joyce, what are you doing today? Are you crafting? Or are you just at home? Or are you making jewelry? Joyce is cute, she makes jewelry, she's so sweet. Um, let's see here, then we get another bag. Let's check this one out. Ooh. Now, this is nice. Look at this. Look at this. This is wonderful. So, that was three bags of fabric squares. Three dollars. Three dollars. Can't go wrong with that. Three dollars. And let's see. We got one final. This, too, was a... I think this is... They weighed this. I think they put it on a scale and they weighed this, but I thought it was kind of cute. I thought this was a nice piece of fabric. I like the colors in that. You could do a lot with that. That's cute. And then this other little piece that says, hmm, creativity. Let's see, creativity is contagious. Uh, pass it on. That's kind of cute. And then, of course, I like this. And this is a whole nice piece for $2. $2. So that was my day today going to the Southeast Fiber Arts Alliance. And they are on Hospital Avenue in Chambly. I never even knew the place existed, actually. Um, but I'm telling you, they told me that they were having, if you like to learn how to dye fabrics, next week, 
day and you can bring all the fabrics that you have. And for $10, they'll have all the dye buckets available and you can take all your fabrics and you can dunk it and create your own dyes. Now I'm thinking it would be good to go and get some white fabric and then take it over there and then dunk it and make your own batik. Do you think that might be a good idea? I think that might be kind of cool. Hmm. Well, anyway, so I just wanted to pop in to show you what my haul was for today. And if you're interested, take a, go on down there. I know I'm going to go maybe check it out and go take a class. Their website is www.fiberartsalliance.org. And it's a fine arts community of fiber people, and I think you might like it. So go ahead and take a look, and um, I'll be back later. And I will talk to you. And have a great night. Bye now.